Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and hi if you are new. Today I'm sharing with you a realistic cleaning motivation video. I hope that this video gives you lots of cleaning motivation, but I also wanted to do this video as a way of saying thank you guys so much for 500 subscribers here on this channel. It feels like such an amazing milestone and as a way of saying thank you, I wanted to give you guys a little giveaway. So I'm going to show you some of the things that you can win and then I'm going to tell you how you can enter. So the first thing that I am including in this giveaway is by my favorite skincare brand Latika Skincare. These are all natural, amazing ingredients that they use in all of their products and this is their body cream. It is a milk and honey with aloe vera and shea butter and it smells absolutely delicious and it is so wonderful on the skin so I thought you guys would love that so I'm going to include that in the giveaway. It also would not be a giveaway for me if I did not include a Bath & Body Works product. So this is a Kitchen Lemon hand soap. I love their candles and hand soap, so I thought that this would be a perfect thing to include as well. I asked y'all over on my Instagram if you wanted me to include some cleaning products in my giveaway, and y'all said yes, so I'm giving away two Scrub Daddy products. The first one is a Scrub Mommy. It is a dual-sided sponge. And then I'm going to be giving away two eraser daddies, which are just like the Mr. Clean Magic erasers. They are so amazing. So I'm going to include those as well. Another thing that I wanted to include in this giveaway is just a little piece of me. I am such a planner. I love writing things down and being organized. So I found this adorable little notebook and pen set so that you guys can stay organized too. So I'm going to include that as well. And the last thing I'm going to be giving away is a $10 Target gift card because Target is one of my absolute favorite stores to shop at. And I know a lot of y'all love it too. So now that I've shared with you everything that's going to be in the box that I'm going to send for the giveaway, let me tell you how you can enter to win. So the only thing that you need to do is make sure that you are subscribed to my channel and that your subscriptions are public so that way I can verify that you are subscribed. And make sure that you leave a comment down below letting me know that you are entering to win the giveaway so I can verify that you are subscribed. But you can also get an extra entry by going over to my Instagram and making sure that you are following me over there. So I will leave my Instagram handle so you guys can go and check me out on Instagram if you are already not following me and let's go ahead now and jump right into the cleaning video in the best ways the best ways i know why we say goodbye but can we turn that by into hello I always start every cleaning video for the most part in my kitchen because this is just where the biggest mess is and I'm going to start today by cleaning out the sink. I had definitely neglected it for a little bit so I always love using my barkeeper's cleanser on the stainless steel and then I'm going to move on to wiping down the cabinet faces and the countertops. I don't do cabinet faces very often but this was also something that was way overdue. And as always, let me know what you guys are doing while you are watching today. Are you cleaning along with me or are you sitting and relaxing? Let me know what you're doing down in the comments below. cleaning routine is pretty much my normal weekly cleaning routine. I don't always do my sink every day and I certainly don't wipe down appliances or the fronts of the cabinets every day, but I do try to do these things at least once a week just to kind of keep things tidy. I really don't like to let things go in the kitchen for too long just because I know that it gets so germy in there with food and everything else. I also feel like this is the room in the house that gets traped through the most. We always go in and out the back door and so there's always dirt and things on the floor so I try to keep this area as tidy as possible
anybody else with white cabinets feel like they have to wipe them down very frequently, I certainly know that I do, especially in this area where I do most of my meal prepping, and I always wipe down my countertops, but I don't always use the granite cleaner because it's just not necessary for every day. It's usually a once a week thing. So I am using my Method Granite Cleaner here. I have also tried the Jaws Granite Cleaner, and they are both really great products if you have granite countertops. My mistakes haunt us, but do they really daunt us? Your tongue can be sharp, you've cut me close to the heart. But we can master the art, and the thing is that these scars are scary, but they are just some old scars. We should never be afraid of them. You and I know. my diffuser here with a blend of lemon essential oil and a tea tree blend and then we are going to move on to cleaning the bathroom next love including little clips here of my robot vacuum. I know that a lot of you guys have reached out to me saying that you love seeing my robot vacuum in my videos because it makes you want to get one so badly. And honestly, if you don't have a robot vacuum and you have hard floors like I do, I would highly, highly recommend it just to kind of keep up with those everyday messes. And now we're going to move on to the living room. I'm just going to wipe down this glass table here and then we are going to straighten up and vacuum this carpet. rugs here on top of the carpet are the ones that I have by the front and back door. I just find it so much easier after I shake them to vacuum them when they're on top of the carpet instead of leaving them on the hard floor to vacuum. They just slide around a little bit too much when I vacuum them on the hard floor. So I'm going to give these a quick vacuum and then I'm going to vacuum the main carpet next. Spinning like a broken record For a player you don't know that many major we hang out and then you get bored And you leave me here like I'm your f landlord You come back and say I'm sorry boo And I know you never mean it gets you in though Did you call me cause you had to Cause you know I throw your suitcase out the window Another something that I try to do every week is clean my bed sheets. Sometimes I don't get it done every week and it's every two weeks. 
but it really just kind of depends. I feel like in the summertime, especially when it's hot, you're sweating more often at night. It's really important to clean the bed sheets more often than you would maybe in the winter time. But I'm gonna throw these sheets in the wash and then we are going to vacuum the upstairs carpets because it had been a while since I had done those. With desire, they sure know how to set a girl on fire. loving spending so much time in my office now that it is completely renovated and if you guys missed that video then I will link it in the description box if you guys want to see how I transformed this room into my dream office but I'm still kind of considering getting a small rug to put here on top of the carpet I really love that layered look when you have a rug on top of carpet so I'm thinking I want to get something super fun with a pop of color just to make this little nook here a little bit more separate from the rest of the room but I'm gonna keep my eyes peeled for something that is super cute and we'll keep looking. I always prefer to use my dry swiffer on the staircase just because these stairs are real wood so I can't really put anything damp on them so I'm just using a dry swiffer pad and obviously my robot vacuum won't work on the staircase and sometimes I feel like I could probably vacuum them but the vacuum is just so big and bulky that I don't want to carry it up and down the stairs. But anyway, that's going to be it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a comment down below and let me know that you are subscribed to my channel so that you can enter to win this amazing giveaway as a way of saying thank you so much for 500 subscribers here on my YouTube channel. I love y'all so much. Please make sure to hit the like button if you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys again very soon in a brand new video. Bye guys.